Well, tonight marks one month since the suspected MS-13 murders of four young men in central Islip. And here on the island, a group has been fighting to help at-risk teens. It's known as the Council for Unity. Our Eileen the Palmer has more in our continuing coverage. Gang terror on Long Well, the Westbury Middle School, the latest Long Island school to join on with the Council for Unity. It's a group made up of thousands of people. It includes curriculum in schools as well as programs in correctional facilities. Now, the aim is to keep kids out of trouble, to keep them out of gangs. There was an induction ceremony today in Woodbury. About a thousand kids joined in, including the kids from Westbury Middle School. I thought it would just be good for me to be a part of it too, like so we could be part of a family in one. I learned how to control how I talk to people, like be nicer to adults and stuff like that. People draw to these gangs because they're not, they feel they're not getting the attention and love from home. And that may be true in a lot of cases, especially in today's generation. But they deviate to the gangs because they have that figure or whatever it is they hook up to, and everything's negative on the street gang level. And the founders of Council for Unity say programs like this are important to address what they say are the societal issues that lead to gang trouble. Now, again, this is all coming on the one-month anniversary of the four bodies being found in a central Islip Park. Suffolk police still investigating, but have said those murders were committed by members of the MS-13 gang. We are in Westbury. Eileen LaPalmer, News 12, Long Island.